hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here you're welcome my name is zara hold up before we continue this conversation okay just subscribe if you have not subscribed like just subscribe if you have not subscribed because in this video and the subsequent videos in this series i'm going to be releasing some juicy information some juicy secrets you know so you have to subscribe if you're interested in this video So this second MB ish or second MB videos or second MB series is like one of the most, if not the most, I think it is the most highly requested video here on my channel. Finally, I have completely drafted out these videos. Like I want it to be a playlist, I want it to be a series because if you are new to my channel and you don't know, this is actually the main reason why I started doing med medical school content on my channel. During my second MB days, oh my god, long story, but let's just wrap it up. During my second MB days, I was looking for um, um, Nigerian medical school content creators here on YouTube, but I really couldn't find any. So I was like, okay, okay, after second MB, I'm going to start making med school videos. And since then, since what, two years and how many months? Two years and about a month now, we have... I have not made one second MB related video and it's just too bad. Okay, so basically this is the introductory video to the series, the second MB series. So once again, I appeal to you, subscribe and like this video and also leave your comments or your questions in the description box if there's anything you want to know about second MB. I already have a few videos that I have drafted out and they're going to come out subsequently after this one. I'm going to try and make them come out almost at the same time so you guys are wondering what's the second mb if you're in second mb class you already know what second mb is if you're not in second mb class like if you're in first year or if you're in second year or if you're just even in secondary school and you're watching this video i don't know what second mb is i'm about to educate you guys on what second mb is so basically medical school nigeria awards the mbbs certificate and also the mbchb there's no difference between the two um, degrees are the same thing just they just choose to have different names i don't know why so the mbbs is a professional degree and every class you go into is actually a six-year program in most universities in most universities in nigeria let's not go into that if you want to go into the struggles of being a nigerian medical student just click this video here i made this video about a year ago no it's not a year but just click that video here and you get all you get the gist about the struggles of being a nigerian medical students okay it takes six years in most universities to complete the mbbs program and within your stay in this program you're going to be writing professional exams at the end of every i'll say every year but it's not every year <laughs> it's not every year but i'll say every year so you're going to be writing professional exam at the end of every year these exams are called mb exams for example second mb exams the reason why you're here Third MB exams, fourth MB exams, fifth MB exams, aka final MB exam. After your first year in medical school, when you cross over, we call it crossover because you're moving from pre med to pre clinicals. And your pre clinicals is your second year and third year. That's like 18 months in my school. In my school. Emphasis on my school because I know that it may be different for, from other schools. If the case is different in your school, please leave a comment in the comment section. Start crossing over from first year and getting to second year. That is when you begin your second MB class. So usually they call second MB class the third year, but this is how I like to see it. If you're in second year, you're in second MB class. Because the truth is that is what you what you do from second year to third year that is going to form the bulk work, bulk work of your second MB exams. So it's not what you only do in third year that is your second MB exam. It's what you do from second year to third year. So if you're in second year, you're in second MB class. But they are writing it in the next 18 months, they are writing it in the next three months, you are in second MB class. Because I feel like this is one of the reasons why people used to relax and chillax. And when the time comes, everybody is now tense because they were not calling you second MB class. But if you're in second year, just take it that you're the second MB class and start doing whatever you have to do now. Don't wait for when the people that are supposed to write second MB, your seniors, write second MB. Then everyone will say, ah, second MB class, so second MB class. So you not be excited, you not be pressured, you not be tense. No idea. Start early. Your second MB starts from your second year 
preparation for your second year starts from your second year. It's only done after 18 months in my school again. After 18 months. And basically, within this period of time, you're going to be doing three main courses. Anatomy, Physiology, and Biochemistry. I've done a video about how medical school works in Nigeria or I forgot what I titled the video, but I'm going to leave it up here and also in the description box. So by the end of this video, when you're done watching this video, you can go and help yourself out and get other information. You do three main courses, yes, anatomy, physiology, and biochemistry. But in anatomy, anatomy has like three embedded in it, embedded in it. that is the gross anatomy, the histology, and the embryology also known as the macroscopic anatomy the microscopic anatomy and the developmental anatomy how medical school works is that they like to introduce you to the normal early on to the normal function of the body the normal state of the body how the body is normally in an apparently healthy individual and this is usually the preclinical stage this is your second mb stage then after the second MB stage, when you successfully pass, and I pray you do, you're going to move to your clinicals, where you now start doing everything that is abnormal in the human being. So that is why your foundation has to be very, 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 this very is plenty, but your foundation has to be strong. You have to know the normal. You have to understand the normal for you to know when something is actually abnormal. That is why second MB is like the most critical exam. Within this period of time, you're going to be learning about the whole body, like the normal functioning of the whole body for 18 months, 18 good months. Anatomy is going to tell you about like the body structures, how they came to be from birth, how they developed. That's embryology now. Histology will tell you about the cells, going to the microscopic bits about the human body. Gross anatomy will tell you about the gross features, things that you can see and things that are underneath your skin that you can see. While physiology will tell you the normal functioning of the body. Then biochemistry is going to tell you about the chemistry, the chemicals that goes on in your body, how carbohydrate is digested, how it's, how it's turned to energy, glucogenesis, and all those things like that, and the metabolism and everything. It's telling you about the chemistry aspect of your human body, okay? So these are the three main courses that you do in second MB. After each semester, you're going to write a test, which is in an exam format. It's over 100 usually mcq in most of them well i think physio is usually essay yes physiology is usually essay while others are usually mcq you're going to write the test in an exam format it's going to be scored over 100 even when the result comes out it's going to be scored over 100 and at the end of the day it's going to be broken down and reduced and shrinked to form your continuous assessment which is part of which takes a certain percentage of the total examination at the end of the 18 months so within this time so let's say 18 divided by three that's six so let's say six months for each second mb is usually the third semester is usually the shortest actually it's not up to six months but let's just say six so at the end of each six months you're writing a test at the end of each six months you're writing a test basically and in my opinion, in my opinion, others may tell you differently. The best place to get your marks, to start getting your marks, is in your test. The CA is usually over 30. If you have 20, over 30. Because now you're doing it in little bits. When you're done with first semester, you have first semester test. When you're done with second semester, you have second semester test. Only on things that were done in second semester. Third semester, same thing. Only things that were done in third semester. Then your mock then practicals, then different places where your continuous assessments will matter. All together will form that 30 marks. If you can get good, good scores in these little chunks, if you have over 20, honestly, what you need to pass is 30 out of 70. Hello, half of 70 is 35. In fact, you have passed. I don't know, but obviously, you should not seek to get a 50 in second MB because anything can happen. And um, the next video after this is going to be the how the examination like how the examination works how it is graded how it is situated how it is organized and how it is structured but for now this is just the introduction 
to the second MB series and right after this the next video is going to be up so if you have not subscribed subscribe if you have not liked this video like this video if you have not asked me questions if you have not left questions or comments in the comment section do it now thank you so much guys for watching don't forget to like this video again subscribe if you have not subscribed and leave your comment below i love you as always i hope this series is helpful to someone and i pray in my heart of hearts that you pass this exam in jesus name amen bye guys love you as always Mwah.